VPs, it's your girl Miss V London and I'm back again for another video by a company called Nasty Girl. If you're new to this channel, please make sure that you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell because you need to know when I upload. That's really important. And um, make sure that you hit a like for your girl because that's nice. Like I like when I see you guys liking stuff, then I know what I'm supposed to be doing. Today we're going to be ha um, looking at some spring and summer clothes and loungewear. If you want to see what I got, make sure you stay tuned. Okay, so this first set is a suit, it comes together, and um, it's in the sage green color. If you know anything about like the trend in patterns and colors and stuff like, you'll know that sage green is one of the colors that are really in this year. So um, it's this short sweatsuit two-piece, comes together. The good thing about Nasty Girl, I love these, I love these websites that actually try and trick you into thinking that they're always giving you a sale but your website is always on sale, but that's okay. Like we're not hating on you, do your thing, because it gives us the money off and it makes us feel like we're not spending too much. But to be fair, Nasty Girl's clothing is really inexpensive. It's quite lightweight, it's polyester. I got this in a size 16. It's got these really nice over the, the um, hand long sleeves, like they're, they're longer than your average sleeves, which is good because when you're lounging, you definitely want to just uh, be cozy, you know. I usually sit here on my cell phone and just be cozy or whatever. And then, so you've got this nice and lightweight um, feel, and then you have these shorts. So here it is. Um, it's nice and comfortable, not too tight, not too short. Feels to me just like really good loungewear. I want to get up and I want to just put something on and I don't want to have to think about it and I want to look cute and when the doorbell rings I can go to the door and I still look I still look cute you know what I mean so this is the perfect perfect loungewear for me I absolutely love it definitely keeping this around let me know what you guys think okay so <coughs> God, I was choking that is because it looks cloudy right Thinking, did you not run your tap? No, it's coconut water. So I actually prefer organic coconut water, but I couldn't find any. So this is just, you know, your regular one that you get in the supermarket. The next two pieces that we have, um, I have a t-shirt, size 14 to 16, very inexpensive, but again, prices will be in the description box. I don't think that this is more than 10 pounds, okay? So it's this senorita on it, it's just a plain white t-shirt. I will say that it's, um, it's not particularly thick, if you know what I mean, like, obviously we don't want our t-shirts to be thick, but you know that a good quality cotton, I'm not sure that it's that really good quality cotton, but, you know, it's a t-shirt and, and to me it does the trick. Senorita is a nice little touch on there, I suppose, and that is, I don't know if you can tell, but I think it's like a burnt orange. Maybe it looks kind of red on the screen, I don't know. But it's a burnt orange colour and yeah, that's all that is. Just a nice kind of oversized casual fit t-shirt. Um, there's not really that much that you can say about a t-shirt, right? If you're trying out a new brand, it's definitely always good to have a go with the jeans. These are the Plus Ripney Freyhem skinny jeans in a size 16. They're not your really super great quality denim, like stretch jeans at all. Um, the style of them are nice. They kind of remind me of a Pretty Little Thing jean, which I'm not a massive fan of Pretty Little Things jeans because I just don't feel like I need good quality jeans. You got When you've got thighs and you've got hips and balm and all this kind of stuff you need some really good jeans that can hold you together for a while i do like the design of them though they look like a jean that are very fashionable oh, the color is nice the wash is really nice i don't know what's going to happen when you try to wash it like if it will still stay this blue as you can see they are super high-waisted like they go over my belly button but the problem that i also have have with these jeans is that the distance between the crotch area the crotch area and the waist here is really long i don't know if i've I don't know, but to me it feels really long. And actually, <laughs> I don't. You probably can't tell, but this is not going all the way up. Um, but if it went all the way up, it would be underneath my boob. So that to me just tells me that the ratio of the cut of these jeans is kind of a little bit off, in my opinion. But these are just not my favourite cut of skinny jeans. Although I do feel that they look quite nice. They look nice, but they're not comfortable like how I would like them. So anyway, here these jeans are. I've still got these um, jeans on, but, and I've got no top under this, but I wanted to show you this is this cover up. They had this in this cream color, they also had this in black. So basically this is like, um, like a nice loose cover up. I actually like this for these summery days. 
so it's this kind of chiffon material i would definitely double this up as like a cover up for you know like over your jeans and stuff like i think it looks nice over this with a nice like maybe like a nice little white top or a, like a bralette or something like that and it's got these strings here and you can pull it together and then you just tie this up they could have made the string a bit longer i mean come on but hey we live um i would definitely wear this over a bikini black bikini okay so there you can see like it pretty much goes like just a little bit above um the floor which is a good length because you don't want this kind of thing dragging on the floor because it's going to get dirty i think the black one would have been great to get this is a good thing to have both colors in and because they're so cheap i would probably just pick up both colors this next outfit i tried to buy things in outfits but i don't know if it came across like that with this tassel thing and these um flare leg um trousers which i'll show you in a minute it actually is giving me a 70s kind of Farrah Fawcett kind of vibe, right? Do you guys agree? Got this in a size 18. I would say you could stick it a regular size. Like you don't need to go up in this. It's quite a thin, lightweight um, material. It's white. It's got the scoop neck. So I think it's called the scoop neck tassel trim bodysuit in white. Yes. They also had this in black, which I was going to pick up. But again, I'm just trying this. I'm kind of getting a feel for the brand still. So I don't want to pick everything up. But this is nice, like very, very lightweight. If I turn around, you can see, yeah, obviously you, you're going to see like some rolls and stuff like that, but I don't think it's too bad. I actually quite like it. Great for the summer. Like I think it's perfect. Fits well, clips up well. It's great. The next thing is something I'm actually quite excited about. These trousers. Now, these, I think people call them, I've heard all kinds of names. They're flare leg trousers. These are a size 16 and they are completely stretchy. They have a lot of different designs in the in these flare leg trousers and I think that they are something good and comfortable that you can keep around. This paisley print again gives me that 70s vibe but they have other prints if you don't like paisley. But I feel like these are really comfortable. A lot of people like them because they say that they give you like a really good... Hey, hey. Sorry. They say that they give you a really good like jiggle when you're walking and... I don't know, I don't know. Okay, so what I will, will say with these is that they are really good for my height. So if you're a bit shorter, you might find that these are a little bit um, too long for you, but these are a good length for me to wear um, flip-flops or something like that, which I could do in the summer months. But even, even if I wanted to, to wear some heels, they're still really good length for me as well. I'm, I'm definitely like feeling this, this look here. So you guys tell me what you think of it. Is it something that you would try and wear? The next thing that I've got on, so I've kept on this um, shimmer, 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 and I've put on these mum shorts. These are the distressed mum shorts, something like that. Um, and I am in love. That's all I'm going to say. If you don't like them, I just don't know. I don't know if me and you are vibing because I really, really like these. These are so comfortable. To be honest with you, my favorite type of jeans lately are my mum jeans. Some people don't like them because they think they make them look bigger and things like that. And they can be quite hard to find if you want a, a good pair, but I can do a haul on those. But I really like these. Again, these have no stretch and which is why, you know, going up a size may be a good idea anyway, because um, even if the waist is big, the size and stuff are not gonna give you any give so you might want to go up a little way. And these are just so comfortable. Like, they're just the perfect length for me. Like, they're not too short, but they are, like, they cover my bum. And I feel like this is something that I'm going to be rocking all summer. So I would suggest that you click on the link and get yourself a pair of these because these are banging. They're banging. Like, they are. Just try and tell me different. Okay, so we are building here. We're building, we're layering. This is the double-breasted plus-size white blazer. I probably made that name up, but it's something to that effect, okay? So it is a double-breasted blazer, as you can see from the, the button structure. And I got this in white. They had this in black as well, but, you know, it's summer. I wanted something in white, and I love this. But this jacket is really nice. I got this in a size 18. It is a really lightweight blazer. So it's going to be great for the summer months. I think this is something that you can wear over your jeans. Like I said, you can wear it over your shorts. You could like go cash. Like, I would definitely go cash in this and wear some like, you know, some nice designer type flip flops or something like that. Some glasses and just be bougie. 
for a daytime thing. And then you can obviously take this out over a nice um, evening dress, a mini dress, something like that in the summer months and just be looking good. Because white always makes you look what? Godly. Makes you look what? Godly. Okay. So yeah, this is it. It's a nice length. Um, perfect. I probably would never button this up, but I definitely can. Like I can, I can close it up and button it up if I wanted to. Um, I think it's probably a bit too short for me for a blazer dress, but some of you might get away with it in a blazer dress if you just buttoned it up and maybe, you know, went like that. Are you vibing? Are you, are you feeling my vibe today or not? I'm feeling my vibe today. But anyway, this is that piece. And in my mind, it's telling me 25 pounds. Something is, the, the ancestors or something are saying 20, 25, 25. I think that's what it is. This is the next thing, same same shorts, but I need something to pop to, to have on with this. And I think that this is a great combination. It is a jumper and I know it, the weather is definitely getting warmer, but I do feel like, you know, when it's, it's spring now, in the dead of summer, you're probably not gonna wanna wear this jumper because it is a really heavy quality. This lemon yellow color is another color that if you can catch it, grab it because they don't tend to make very many things for adults in lemon yellow so when i saw this i was like no i need it so this is off the shoulder um jumper i actually got this in a size 22 because it's the last one that's there that was there um and i think they still have 22 so i would say if you're somebody that doesn't mind to wear your, your stuff like really oversized i think that you could get away with this from a size 14 to a size 22 basically um i feel like it can fit everybody so don't just think oh there's not there's not my size there just try it and see what happens especially with these kinds of slouchy kind of fits you can have it one shoulder on one shoulder off you can i'll show you how long it is Ooh. so this is the length of it here so you can have it out and have that kind of casual look i just tucked the front part in but you could tuck one side in here we are This is the two-piece waffle knit loungewear set. So it's definitely a loungewear set. And they come in small, medium, and large. So I would say to you, just don't be afraid to try different sizes because you never know. This is a very, very stretchy piece. So for, for my plus size ladies that are my size or bigger, don't be fooled by the numbers. Don't be fooled by the letters. Just try things out. Um, and I would just say that this is like a really cute and comfortable loungewear set. This is the kind of set that I could see myself getting up and um, putting on just because I'm going to be in the house all day and I just want to be cute and comfortable. Very much like the Sage two-piece set. The length of the legs, if you can see, they are really, really long. Like even if I tiptoe, which I always do, um, they're still dragging the floor. So that was another reason why I wish that I got the pink one because I did have this in pink because this is dragging the floor and it's probably going to get dirty. But hey ho, we're in the house and we're lounging, so it doesn't really matter. Nice high waisted fit, probably a bit see through, but who cares? Hi MVP, so you made it to the end of this mammoth try on haul. Kudos to you because it was a long haul. There was a lot of things in there and I really hope that that was useful for you. So I tried to condense it as much as I could, but I wanted to show you guys outfits. I wanted to not just like individual pieces, but how you could put things together. I also really hope that you've seen that you don't have to be, like I said in the video, a slave to numbers and letters. Try things out, look at the materials. That's really important because you could be a size 12 in something and a size 20 in something else, depending on the stretch and the way your body is shaped and made up. Make sure you check, trick? Make sure you check the description box because that's where I'm gonna have all the links and the sizes that I bought. If I cannot find the exact item because maybe it sold out, I will link something similar from their website. So don't worry, I've got you on that front. Please make sure that you subscribe like because you're gonna to wanna to come back because I've got other things that I'm gonna do and you're gonna miss it if you don't subscribe. So do that right now. Okay, so now that you've pressed that, make sure you hit the notification bell and press all in the drop down menu so that you get my, um, notification every time of my video every time that i drop one i love you guys so much make sure you hit the thumbs up i don't have any nails on this is the first time in years that i haven't had nails on but it's hard times okay so in these hard times make sure you guys stay safe and i love you guys so much my name is miss b london i'll see you next time bye